Hello, I'm Steve from hifiheadphones.co.uk. We're at CanJam, Russell Square, London, 2015, and we're here to try what's hot, what's not, cool in other words, and um, just um, generally make a nuisance of ourselves. I've got my lanyard, I've got my microphone, and um, we're hot to trot. We're going to trot round now and um, just see what's what. Hi, um, we're Hi-Fi Man, it's actually this is our first show in the UK, so we're very excited. We bring over our new uh, Hotstar HE1000 here, we're getting a line in the morning already, and also the uh, new the HE400S, which is um, very le less expensive planner headphones, that's also getting a lot of buzz recently. Yeah, we've been very busy, non non stop, which is always good. To I see. expect so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so we've got a few new bits. We've got uh, the the in ear headphones from Fostex, which yes. is new for them. Uh, a single balanced arm armature design, a, a dynamic, and a and a slightly cheaper dynamic as well. And the 500, which has been been around slightly less long, but still it's still a year now. That that does very well. Some people prefer the 500 to the 900, and it's a different, very different sound. The mid mids yeah. are, are very strong on the RP driver. But the newest thing I guess we've got this year is the uh, studio headphones, which are the the new RP series. Uh, and uh, yeah, I mean for for the money they're 115 a pair, and people have been listening and saying, you know, wow, yeah, <laughs> that's that's a that's a lot for your money. Well, it's the first time for us in the UK standing in shows here. So, um, of course, Ken Gem UK was the first time. So, we have been getting a lot of reviews about the first product. This is our first product. We're a new company. We've been around for um, 18 months. So, this is our first product, the S1 Plus. And we're also doing a preview of the new T1, which is uh, the gentleman that's wearing it right now. So, that's a preview. That's a T1. That will be our on ear, whereas this is an over ear. Our brand is just fully focused on wireless headphones, or just wireless. Even the audio files would find that this would be good enough. Of course, we're not trying to compare with any of those thousand uh, dollars headphones out there yet. Yeah. So we're, we're just trying to say that uh, a wireless can sound so good now that it'll be good enough for most of even the most uh, particular listener. It's going very well. We have the full range of Odyssey kit here today, ranging from the ear lapes up to the LCD 3s and also the Deckard amplifier as well. The closed back ear lapes and the LCD XCs seem to have been more popular today than, uh, than expected. Um, so it's going very, very well. I think the Deckard is a very underestimated product for the price point you get in a lot of amplifier for 599. It powers all of the headphones and it powers them very well. You've got your USB input, phono input, and you've also got a variable output as well to connect to a main system or whatever it might be if you wanted to. I've just got a couple of new models basically. Um, I've got the T1 second generation, which has just come out, just been released. Basically, it's just slightly updated T1. They've fixed a bit of a peak in the trebles, so they're a bit smoother, and added a tiny bit of bottom end as well to make them very, very nice to listen to, basically. Quite relaxing, non-fatiguing sound, and they've been popular so far, along with a detachable cable that can be balanced as well. We've also got the DT1770, um, which are basically a high-end studio headphone. Um, they again use Tesla drivers, like all their high-end headphones, and again come with a detachable cable. Again, it's what people came to love from the 770s, yeah. just added layer of detail and precision to the sound, and also extension down low has greatly improved, and the bass hump's not as big. We've had a really good day showing off the T20 and T20i, which is the, the new one that uh, we announced actually back in Munich, but kind of has on, gone on sale throughout the summer. So this is one of the first times actually been kind of available to demo in the UK. So a lot of people are very interested in that. We've had some great reviews so far and, and some great feedback today, as I said. Uh, we're also debuting the, uh, the S500i. It's kind of a last minute preview. It's officially launching next week at IFA. So, um, we, we brought that here just to show off the head fires. You know, it's, it's, it's a very affordable product compared to a lot of the things here. It's, it kind of retails at $29.95 and $39.95 for the, for the two different versions. So, you know, this is, uh, 
it's a very, very affordable product, but it, we've done a lot of really interesting things with it. It's, it's a very, very compact, it's a microdynamic driver, and, and people are, are receiving it very well, you know. The, we've had guys come across from, from the other stands where they've been trying out, you know, $1,500 headphones and come over and try our 40 quid headphones and say, you know, hey, you guys, you're onto something here in terms of that price performance ratio that we always try and hit with our products. Yeah, I mean, it's been really, really busy. Uh, we've constantly had a really busy table, which is great. We've got Hugo here, the three Hugos, and we've also got Hugo TT over there, which is, um, I think, one of the first opportunities to actually listen to it in the UK at a show. Everyone who's come up to our table has said, I've heard the Hugo, can I listen to the TT? Great news. And the one other thing that I did really pick up on, um, that's made us all smile, is the amount of people walking around with Hugos saying, this is amazing, and that really brings a smile to our face, and I'm glad to see it. One of the best things as well is to see uh, people come along with um, their own headphones and listen to it, walk away saying that sounds incredible. That's really, really good, really confidence building. Well, it's been very busy so far today. It's been great, but uh, we're showing some new headphones that we've just brought out. So we've got the Kef M500, which is our flagship model. Uh, we're showing them in uh, the new white finish and the new black finish as well. Um, we have the classic silver and black finish that you can see in this lovely picture here. And then the M400, which is our latest model, uh, which sits in between the M5 and the M100, which is an in-ear model that we've just brought out. And uh, that's what we're demonstrating today. Okay.